I forgive you. Those three words aren't always easy to say when someone hurts or upsets us, but forgiving and letting go of negative feelings can have a very positive impact on your mental and physical health. SSM Health family medicine physician and wellness coach, Dr. Rupa Shaw, joins me to share more about the power of forgiveness. Maybe something we don't think about in terms of our health. Yeah. So how does forgiveness really benefit us from a health standpoint? Yeah, so forgiving um, doesn't mean forgetting and moving on. It's really about letting go of the things that don't serve you. We want to strive for focusing on our health um, and kind of building more inner peace. And that's what forgiveness does. Right. Um, it allows us to move forward in a way that is more positive in life um, and letting go of the things that don't serve us. Anger, resentment, living in the past. We want to live in the present and we just want to be more present in our lives. Absolutely. Yeah. And you know, you talk about that anger, the negativity. Mm -hmm that can also have an impact on our health as well. Absolutely. Holding on to chronic anxiety, to chronic anger and resentment, really what that does is it puts you in a state of chronic fight or flight. And that means that's a high cortisol state. And we know that high cortisol states lead to higher blood pressure, um, higher heart rates, lower immune response, mm. uh, effects on our blood sugar. So these things can lead to heart disease, diabetes, anxiety, depression. So again, the chronic um, anger doesn't serve us, so it's best for us to try and let that go the best we can. Absolutely, yeah. and you know, there are a lot of benefits of forgiving people in your relationships. Yeah. Obviously, we're talking about our health. What are yeah. some of those benefits? Yeah, so again, letting go of some of the things that have happened to you can help build a more stronger, healthier relationship, letting you move forward in that relationship and not living in the past. Again, it can bring you better overall health, right? right. From a cardiac standpoint, from a mental health standpoint. So all of these things really um, can increase longevity um, and just a more uh, healthier kind of life, basically. Right. Yeah. You know, and we've talked a lot about mental health in these conversations. This yeah. feels directly tied to that. And maybe there's still a little separation for people out there about physical and mental health, but they really are tied together. They are so incredible. Uh, intricately linked, right? right? Again, we've talked a lot about our gut and how our gut makes all this serotonin that can affect our brains and that feel good chemical. So when we're not feeling good, we can have physical symptoms, right? right? And vice versa. When we're bogged down with a lot of stress and, and things too, that can affect our mental health. So right. we got to remember that mind body connection that's yeah. really strong. A real yeah. strong connection, got to find the balance yes. as always. As always. All right, Dr. Yes. Shaw, where else can people find you? They can find me on Instagram at Wellness with Dr. Shaw. All right, thank you as always. Thank you.